Okay, good morning. It's time to test. Uh, I don't feel like there's much in there. It might have already evaporated. Let's test the growler, see if this is uh, sealed up better. No, nothing. There's like no carbonation. Interesting. Um, I don't know what happened. I wonder why it didn't kick off. We may have to open one of the bottles later. Well, it's a bummer. Um, well, I guess I will wait a day. No, no, I'll open a bottle because the growler had a significant amount of airspace. All right, amazing breakfast here. One leftover cinnamon roll. And I've got some honey Greek yogurt when I'm putting some granola in. What kind of granola? Pumpkin flaxseed granola for peak caucasity. You know, I'm just gonna... That cinnamon rolls video was actually kind of popular. Got to catch up on my comments here. Here, try this. Is that good? Yeah. So here's one of our bottled ciders. I don't see any sediment formed. Let me look at it in the light. Oh, there is a bit of sediment. Okay, so sediment usually tells you that something happened. Something was in the works there. Let's open her up and see if she would get any carbonation. I don't know, I'm kind of feeling weird. Maybe it's not gonna, oh, there's a bit of a sits. A little pssst. No, it was like no carbonation. Pretty still. Um. Okay, I'm gonna leave these for, I don't know, I'm gonna wait another couple of days and check another bottle and see if they're uh, if they're getting there or not. Cause yeah, right now it's not uh, it's not carbonated at all. It, there was a bit though, so possibly it just needs to sit longer. Well, so I guess in the last out, what's up? What's up? We broke that dance. What? Meatball dance. Meatball dance? No. Meatball. Meatball dance. You want the meatball on your iPad? Yeah. Bring me your iPad. Okay, so, in the last eight hours or so, I have not filmed anything because I've been working on my laptop and we've been doing a lot of cleaning. Meatball. Meatball. Yeah. Oh, it's dead. I have to charge it. Okay. I have to charge it. Okay. Can you take this and put it on the couch? Okay. I'll charge it, I'm sorry. <laughs> Sorry, bud. I'll charge you in a second. Okay. <laughs> so I have not, I've not filmed anything in my day. And to be honest, there's nothing really going on, except that, you know, I was out most of the last week and I gotta get back into my rhythm. And I figured, what better time than to go through my bag, my work bag, and make sure I've got everything I need in it. So first thing, let me, let me take it all apart, show you what's in it. We'll call, if we need to get rid of stuff, we will. We'll put it all back in. This is a case logic bag. Um, I'll post the link on Amazon. I, I don't really recommend it. I, I did go into that Kickstarter for that EDC messenger bag. It's a pretty freaking cool looking bag. I'm pretty excited to get it. And I, I think that it's gonna be like November, maybe, when I get it. So this strap's starting to rip the whole, the, the, the lift strap. Kind of a cheap bag. I think it's like 30 bucks on Amazon. Padding's all worn out. Anyway, let's take a look. Oh yeah, too, before I forget. This is our cleaning totes. Everything you need for cleaning the, the house is all in these convenient little totes that we keep around. Okay, let's dive in. Outside pockets first. Makes this easier. God, we're just getting stuck on. Pepper spray, that's not going anywhere. And a charging brick, 100%, ready to go. Outside, hand sanitizer and a carabiner. Inside the little I don't know, I call it the wallet pocket. This is my badge, I'm not gonna show anybody that. My little business card thing. This is for a uh, tripod mount for a cell phone. Okay. Cell phone, screwdriver, sewing kit, Sharpie, uh, Streamlight, Stylus Pro, a antenna, that is also a pointer. Israeli bandage, personal first aid kit, recycled firefighter notepad, Field notes, uh, acid reducer, in case I get a stomach ache, Ricola, what are these? Oh, these are my Allegra's, gotta have that. Okay, it's a USB cable to micro USD, USB. Old Baofeng cable, we can toss this immediately. These are dollar, those dollar gold, gold coin Sacagawea and President's coins, bit of duct tape, an old mass transit tap card, a roll up thing for headset. Here is a very ultra light headlamp. One lighter, one whistle. No, 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 no. 
Get your baby hands out of here. Started pills. Hey, 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 not everything is for you. You can watch Kenwood Radio, long antenna, and my bulky, dumb work laptop, PlayStation Vita, charging brick. Oh, this is cool. Stanley screwdriver set, Phillips, flat head, small bit, large bit. So believe it or not, this has gotten me out of all kinds of trouble with my clothes. Been able to do little quick fixes. You want to sit over here? You want a flashlight? Okay, here. So I don't see much area where I should change or add to. This is an office environment um, kit, so you know I don't need much more than this. I don't take the MacBook Pro. That's just in there because I was working on my laptop beforehand. What kind of recommendations do you guys have? I probably don't need the PS Vita because I never get a chance to play it. This is for when I was on the train, and I don't know when I'm going to get on the train again. So I'm going to take that out for now. It's kind of bulky. Oh, I know it's missing. My Gorilla Pod. Let me show you how it all goes back in, then. But this is pretty much it. That's all I. That's all I take. Looking at it all spread out, I think like it makes sense. <laughs> this recolo bag's pretty shot. Now, of course, I have a lot of stuff at work, like um, medicines and a small first aid kit and all that stuff. But this is stuff that I always keep on me. And this first aid kit's actually pretty light. I should uh, I should consider revising it. A pair of gloves, gauze, um, some ointment, bunch, and then a bunch of different uh, size band-aids. That's all that is. I should probably consider upgrading that or changing it to a smaller, less bulky container, like one of those uh, waterproof envelopes with the zipper. Let's walk through the method of the madness of putting it all back in. So, big laptop goes in the back in a special sleeve, and this sleeve is like totally stretched out to fit this laptop. It is way beyond the size that this is meant to support. So, if you have a big laptop like this, I don't recommend it. If you have a MacBook Pro or an iPad Air, or a MacBook Air, it's probably fine. The radio goes up against the laptop. The antenna for the radio goes down up against the laptop like that. The brick, charging brick goes down in here. Cable for the brick goes in like that, and that's the main pocket. Close that up. So the inner pocket, well, let's let's get the inner pocket. So there's a pocket inside the inner pocket, and that's where I like to keep the pills. So all the, all the stuff that you're not grabbing at, lighter, keep that out of the way. The Ricola, keep that out of the way. The whistle, the duct tape, cable. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that one. I'm gonna leave that out for now. Yeah, that all goes, this goes in there too. So that's kind of out of the way stuff. That's stuff that you don't need at like a moment's notice. Oh, and the, these coins. These coins only come out usually when I'm uh, when I'm at toll booths. So when I'm in the East Coast, <laughs> more likely. Pens go in the little pen holders when I can shove them in there. This is a really good pen to write with, this ugly pen. But it's like this rubberized grip makes it really hard to put inside the little sleeves in the bags. Okay, highlighter. Daddy, I love it. And you're looking? This is the screwdriver. I've used that quite a few times. Okay, sewing kit goes in this little metal middle pouch right next to the light. Right in the middle, easy to grab. Here's the antenna. Antenna goes to the left. Sharpie to the right. First aid kit goes in the very bottom. It's hard and won't get damaged. Next to it is the Israeli dressing. The two notepad go on top of that. This guy goes up against the sewing kit. Daddy, and then this fills out the, the side right there of the inner pack. Oh, and the micro light. That also goes in the inner pouch. Why do I keep a headlamp plus a... Whoa! Whoa, do not play with that. Why do we take a headlamp plus a flashlight? When you're walking around with a flashlight, you don't look like you're a weirdo or doing something nefarious. When you put a headlight on, people automatically think you're more serious than you really are. So that's that. Unless I'm working on like a server rack or whatever, I don't pull that out. Okay, and then in the wallet pack goes my badge and my business card. This goes on the left side pocket, which is my right hand pocket when I'm wearing it. And then this goes on the other side. And I'll put the cable here, and I'll also add an iPhone cable. And that's my bag. Not great, 
I can't wait until I get that EDC bag. That's gonna change everything. It's gonna change the way I do all of this. Daddy, charge it now. Charge what now? Charge it. iPad. iPad? Meatball. Meatball? Meatball, Chancy, uh, Cloudy with a chance of meatballs too? Yeah. On the iPad. But I have to charge the iPad first, right? Okay. Yeah? Yes? Yeah. Right? Yeah. You want me to do that right now? Of course. Yes? Of course. Of course? Yeah. Okay. All right, those are the uh, the bottles. We're going to wait and see what those look like tomorrow. I'll open another one. All right, say goodbye, Ben. Bye. Good night. Bye. <laughs> see you tomorrow. Say see you tomorrow. Okay, see you guys.